Was it an easy decision to come back for the series finale? Oh, we were done. We started calling last fall. I mean, you guys do want us to come back. Why haven't you called already? Just because we came home. We went home. It turned out years ago. We had a school opportunity. We asked for a board game. In fact, we didn't think we ever wanted to come back. Why aren't you calling? Why, why aren't you calling? Why? Oh, you're calling. Oh, you're calling. You're calling. No, it was a very easy decision. Such an important show for us in our life, for our fans. Uh, it was yeah, a no-brainer. We couldn't wait to do it. And will we get to see a grown-up Neil? Well, you get to see a, a, a nine, ten-year-old Neil. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, and briefly, how you see it? Was it fun to get to play with some of the new characters? We, okay, I don't want to give anything away, but we finished on our presence in the <laughs> It's very old school once upon a time when you see us, but yes, the possibility of playing with some of the new characters was awesome. And how has it felt to see like merchandise, pop vinyls and all that made of your characters? Our kids love it, and they don't get that that's weird. <laughs> I mean, it's such an honor, you know, and it's such an honor that it's entered into the consciousness of people, and people love these characters, and they've taken these characters as their own. I mean, you can't ask for any more than that. But what do you have to say to the fans who have stuck with the show for six, seven years, you know, to watch you and these characters come together? Thank you, Webster. We couldn't have done it without you. We wouldn't have done it without you. We did it for you. We've been the best. The monsters are so passionate, you are so smart, and thank you so much for allowing us to tell these stories and coming along the way. So, thank you.